Hi everybody! So I've got another five minute craft for you. Um, Aria has just discovered that Play-Doh isn't food, it's actually to play with. Um, so I thought I'd embrace that and um, I found a really cool idea on Pinterest. Um, so all you need is paper, pens, some laminating pouches, a laminator if you have one, and if you don't, straighteners work. Um, and yeah, so what you do is you draw on your piece of paper, I've already done this one, draw on your piece of paper um, whatever you whatever you want um, and then you laminate it. So this one as you can see is a plate, knife, fork and spoon. Um, so Aria can do blue peas, you know, pink spaghetti, um, yellow sausages, you know there'll be that kind of thing on there. Um, but I found that this really helps when I'm cooking dinner. So I can put this at the table, she can sit in her seat with the Play-Doh and she can make her own dinner while I'm making dinner. Winner, winner. Um, so that, so how you do it. You've got your laminating pouch and this is, I haven't done this one yet. And um, you've also got your piece of paper. This one is a face. Aria loves drawing faces at the moment. Eyes, nose, mouth, and then an abundance of hair. She loves drawing faces. Um, so um, I thought this one would be really good for her. Um, make sure there's no air in it. So really push all the air out and then start at the top where this it's already sealed. Use your straighteners or if you've got a laminator, um, use your laminator and then you push down all the way along trying to keep it in as line as possible and trying to keep all the air bubbles out and then it will become waterproof um, and shiny just like this one. Um, instead of Play-Doh, you can also use um, whiteboard markers because then they'll just wipe clean. That's a really good one. Um, you can also um, do nature ones. So I've seen um, a bit like this. Um, you can pick flowers and make a daisy chain. You can find um, sticks and stones to make the faces, that sort of thing. Um, so you can do nature pictures and obviously they're waterproof. So it doesn't really matter if they get too wet or muddy. You can just wipe them clean. Um, and then I've seen um, Easter eggs, so you draw the Easter egg and then they can colour it with whiteboard markers, they can do Play-Doh, they can do um, nature, you know, even paint actually, paint would work, you can just wipe it clean. Um, and what else have I seen? I've seen vehicles, um, I've seen, you know, decorate your own car, um, do propellers on a, a helicopter. Um, I've seen a digger, um, so they have to like create the boulders. You could actually use real, real um, rocks and stones, or you can make them out of play-doh. Um, it's a pretty good craft because it's always different. You can literally use your imagination. Um, so yeah, this is really good. Um, as I say, really helped me at dinner time the other night. Um, so I'm lucky. I'm looking forward to do the uh, faces later on today. Um, I hope this has helped any of you. Let me know how you get on. Any questions, also let me know. Have a lovely day, everybody.